He's a complex and brilliant uh, talent who I think lives life a little bit on the edge. Red represents fire, red represents arsenal, red was number. He has that mental discipline of a, of a sweet who wants to win, but as well he has a free spirit and a, a personality. And the uh, combination of both, I believe, made him more than the moment. Freddy Youngberg! Arsenal have produced two absolute stunners! Freddy, welcome to Chicago. This is your first training day at Toyota Park today, correct? A little wet, how'd it go? Yeah, it was a bit of a surprise. It was like being in Seattle. But, uh, no, it went well. We had a hard session, but it was good. Tell me about your expectations of what you would hope for yourself for the next few years here. I mean, what I want is something to stimulate me and, and learn and uh, learn about America and, uh, and especially probably to get soccer growing. Freddy Lundberg, can there be a bigger superstar on the football field from Sweden? I don't think so. Both talking exclusively to talksport.co.uk. Let's go and find out. What do you think? What do you think on the day of the game? I think both teams are a little bit worried, I think, about their form. Uh, of course, England did well defensively against France, but didn't happen much, I think, offensively. Sweden struggled and, and lost. So I think it's two teams that are... I don't know if they're nervous, but they're not really sure where they stand, I think. I love fashion, and I have a lot of friends that work for fashion in clothes. I like to mix um, different styles, uh, maybe have a really nice shirt, jacket, and have maybe some vintage jeans or a bit of messed up, beaten up, and um, I, for me that's fashion when you can mix different stuff that you maybe don't think will fit together. Rolling cameras, 